Hello everyone and welcome to my Days of Our Lives official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Everett's examination prompts Harris's homicide. Days of Our Lives show that Everett Lynch is prepared to completely expose this medication story regardless of the stuff. Everett has figured out how to get an unimportant money asset to take care of street pharmacists and will uncover these vendors yet will his data lead to Harris Michaels, Steve Burton, murder? Days of Our Lives street pharmacists after betray police and columnists. Days of Our Lives uncovers that street pharmacists are not the most solid sources with regards to staying silent. Tragically, cash talks thus take drugs. Everett could pay for data and coincidentally uncover a lot of data which could place Harris in the line of fire. Imagine that Harris is unaware that he is about to expose one of Everett's informants. Days of Our Lives Everett's examination prompts Harris's murder Everett's commitments could make the street pharmacist turn on Harris and target him. One of the sellers could transfer data back to Clyde too. All things considered, Clyde appears to know all that is continuing regardless of anything else. Is it possible that Clyde has an informant at the Salem Police Department who informs him of Harris's plans as well? DOL Everett Lynch could be working with Clyde. Everett has been exceptionally obscure since coming to Salem. Everett likewise has an extremely bizarre tale about why he exited Stephanie Johnson's, Abigail Klein, life. Consider the possibility that Everett is lying about significantly more. Everett very closely resembles Jada Tracker's ex, who went by Bobby. Everett has likewise had an unusual call, to a great extent. Is it possible that Mr. Investigative Reporter uses his position to conceal his involvement in the drug trade? Might Everett at some point perhaps be Clyde's association outwardly? Clyde could certainly benefit from Everett's investigative reporting in order to keep him informed about what the police know and don't know about his movements in Salem. Is Everett taking care of Clyde data, including Harris's examination subtleties? Days of Our Lives spoilers Harris Michaels is slatted to kick the bucket. Harris is the lead agent on this case yet Jada is his accomplice. Tragically, it appears to be that Harris will in general follow leads without his reinforcement. Harris has demonstrated that he will go into rear entryways or any place he wants to go to get data, Harris demonstrated this when the tip was brought in about drugs at the bistro. Will Harris be set up by another tip? Since Harris will in general look at these tips alone and hopes to be shot in a rear entryway, maybe he takes off all alone to look at a tip. As someone fires at Harris, Jada may retreat to take care of something. Has Everett driven Harris into a snare by delivering an excess of data? Will Harris kick the bucket Why attempting to help the inhabitants of Salem? Holly leaves Salem for treatment, Nicole moves her daughter to a new facility. Days of Our Lives reveals that Holly Jonas, who is in a coma following a tragic overdose, will undergo significant changes. Trip Johnson and different specialists on staff have been giving their very best for Holly, however, her advancement has been slow up until this point. Notwithstanding, Days watchers can expect a defining moment for Holly during the seven-day stretch of January 15th to 19th. There will be more expect Holly's full recuperation, however, College Emergency Clinic will not be prepared to handle the subsequent stages. According to Day's spoilers, Holly will be able to get some kind of treatment, but she will have to go to a different facility for it. That is the reason the fundamental arrangements will be made for Holly to travel somewhere else. Obviously, Nicole DiMera might have a few reservations when she gets refreshes on the arrangement, yet she'll likewise get consolation that it's ideal for Holly. Maybe Tripp and Kayla Johnson will guarantee Nicole that this treatment has the best potential for success of returning Holly once again to her old self. When Nicole approves sending Holly to her new office, Holly will be all prepared and all set on Friday, January 19th. That is when Nicole, E.J. DiMera Maggie Kiriakis and Eric Brady will all need to say goodbye to Holly. Despite the fact that Nicole will certainly need to go with Holly, she may be encouraged to remain behind and let the specialists work with no induction. Since Nicole will express farewell alongside Holly's other friends and family, that recommends she'll without a doubt persevere through a detachment while Holly's under new consideration elsewhere. Luckily, Holly isn't leaving days for good. This is only a brief tale directed choice, and that implies Holly won't be off material for a really long time. 
Ashley Puzimus has recorded a lot more scenes to come, so DOL fans will need to remain tuned for the following part of Holly and Tate Dark's Jamie Martin Man, Omsty High Schooler Romantic Tale. Brady called out, Eric visits Teresa, Sloan stresses, Constantine gains advantage days of our lives spoilers indicate that Brady Black will be the target of Kristen Dimra's rant. Holly's brief exit will be followed by her complicated comeback. Eric Brady will come around to perceive how Teresa Donovan is holding up. Sloane Peterson battles with her responsibility over the child switch. Constantine Melionis gets the advantage on Steve Johnson, Stephen Nichols, and John Dark. Kristen Demera gets down on Brady Dark. Days of Our Lives uncover that Kristen will make a move to get down on Brady on his inability to appear for their girl, Rachel Dark, Finley Rose Slater. Brady has been grumbling that Kristen will not permit him to invest energy with Rachel. Kristen at last consents to give Brady time with his little girl and he is a flake out. Kristen will go off on Brady before Marlena Evans just to toss around her weight considering she has guardianship of Rachel. Kristen doesn't really mind how much difficulty Tate Dark is in. Kristen accepts that Brady ought to be there at whatever point she permits him to see Rachel regardless of what else is happening. DOL Eric Brady visits Teresa Donovan. Eric has a ton to share with Teresa after Holly Jonas' excess. Obviously, Tate is getting the fault for this and Eric might accept that EJ Demera is more right than wrong to fault him. Notwithstanding, Alex Kiriakis will be there to have Teresa covered and shield her and Tate from Eric's allegations. DOL Brady called out, Eric visits Teresa, Sloan stresses, Constantine acquires benefit. Meanwhile, Sloane is making some harsh memories maintaining her mystery about Nicole Walker's child also. Nicole is confronting losing her girl only weeks after she lost her child. Sloane doesn't know how long she can keep this up and Melinda attempts to offer her consolation. But if Sloane doesn't do something to fix this, she might not be able to live with herself. Days of Our Lives, Constantine Melionis gets the high ground. Constantine is making an honest effort to keep himself at the Kiriaki Chateau as far as might be feasible and Steve and John are attempting to force him to leave. However, Constantine always seems to return Maggie Kiriakis to her good graces and her home. With Sarah Horton moving out this is definitely not a smart thought. John has taken steps to get the ISA involved yet it appears to be that Constantine has data that will meddle with John's head also. Might these two at any point get Constantine away before he convinces Maggie to accomplish something she will before long lament? Kristen rakes Brady over the coals. Days of our lives bother Brady's in for an earful when he runs into Kristen. Simply wait to hear what she has to say. Days of our lives features. With such a difficult situation in Brady's family the present moment, is anyone shocked Kristen gets down on him? His child is in prison on drug charges and she's the mother of his other kid. Let's face it, Kristen enjoys beating her baby daddy. Watch for her to go off on Brady about his horrible nurturing. Also, she'll do it before Marlena. Goodness, and indeed, it will be exceptionally clearly and extremely emotional. Wonderful Kristen! Simultaneously, Eric visits Teresa and he has a comments, as well. Fortunately for Teresa, Alex is not too far off to support her. In a situation like this, he will not permit anyone to harm her, not even her own cousin. Shame and guilt Sloane struggles throughout to maintain her web of lies, particularly in light of recent events. Is the culpability getting to her realizing Nicole could lose her girl only months subsequent to losing her child? Understand this, figure out what occurred on days of our lives. In the event that there was ever a period for reality to become unavoidable, it would be presently. Nonetheless, Melinda isn't going to allow that to occur. She stands up for her group and convinces her to get off that cliff. Presently, presently, don't bother leaping off this insane train. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.